recite the grass on the hill and memorize the moon. I know the cloud forms of love by heart and have brought tears to the eye of a storm. My memory banks vaults of autumn forests and Amazon river banks and I've screened them into sunsets that echo in earthquakes. Shadows have been my spotlight as I monologue the night and dialogue with days. Soliloquies of wind and breeze applauded by sun rays. We put language in zoos to observe caged thought and toss peanuts and pea funk and intellect and motherfuckers think these are metaphors. I speak what I see. All words and worlds are metaphors of me. My life is authored by the moon, footprints written in soil, the fountain pen of Martian man nobbling human toil. And yes, the soil speaks highly of me. In earth seeds root me, poet, tree. We forest forever through recitation now. Maybe I'm too serious. Too little here. Too matter. Though I'm riddled with the reason of the sun. A stand-up comet with the audience of lungs. This body of laughter, is it with me or at me? You more or less human, though gender's mute. And the punchline has this lifeline at its root. I'm a star, this life's the suburbs I commute. Daily runs between the sun and earthly reading brings my children to the height of life and truth. If I could find the spot where truth echoes, I would stand there and whisper memories of my children's future. I would let their future dwell in my past so that I might live a brighter now. Now is the essence of my domain and it contains all that was and will be and I am as I was and will be because I am and always will be that nigga. I am that nigga. I am that nigga. I am that timeless nigga that swings on pendulums like vines through minds of booby trap minds and enslaved by time. I am the life that supersedes lifetimes. I am. It was me with serpentine hair and a timeless death of the mortal glare to mortal fear in the stone time capsules. They still exist as the walking dead, as I do the original Sufferhead, symbol of life and matriarchy, severed head, Medusa. I am. It was me, the ecclesiastical one, that pointed out that there was nothing new under the sun, and through times of laughter and times of tears, so that no times are real times, as all times of fear, the wise seer Solomon. I am. It was me with tattered clothes that made you scatter as you shuffled past me on the street. Yes, you shuffled past me on the street as I stood there conversing with men blown spirits. And I fear it's your loss you didn't stop and talk to me. I could have told you your future as I explained your present. But instead, I'm the homeless schizophrenic to resent for being aimless. The entombed nameless. I am. I am that nigga. I am that nigga. The Negro, yes, Negro, Negro from Necro, meaning death, though they came into the name me after it. And I'll be spitting at death behind and putting kick me signs on its back because I am not the son of Shaklak Clack. I am before that. I am before. I am before, before, before death is eternity. After death is eternity. There is no death, there's only eternity. And I'll be riding on the wings of eternity like, yeah, 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 Shaklak Clack. I sit like Spitfire, which you call the sun, trying to map out your future with sundials about tic tac technology, can no tic tac me. I just sit right between tick and tock, dodging it like double dutch, got me living double time. I was here before your time, my heart is made of the quartz crystals you be making clocks out of. And I be resurrecting every third like tick, 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 cha clack, clack, no one will work a nine to five because I'm setting suns and orange moons. And my existence is this, still, yet ever moving. And I'm moving beyond time because time binds me, it can set me free and I'll fly when the clock strikes me like yeah, 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 she clack, clack, and my flight doesn't go undisturbed because time makes dreams defer and all of my time fears are turning my days into daymares. I live daymares, you live in nightmares that once haunted my past. She clack, clack, time is beating my ass and I be having dreams of chocolate covered watermelons. Filled with fried chicken like pinatas with little piccaninny sons and daughters standing in front of them with big six aluminum foil hitting them trying to catch pieces of fallen fried chicken wings and Aunt Jemima and Uncle Ben are standing in the corners with rifles pointed at the heads of the little children. Don't shoot the children, I shout. Don't shoot the children, but they say 
it's too late. They've already been infected by time. Any more time, that's the occupation of time, but it's too late. They start shooting at the children and killing them one by one, two by two, three by three, four by four, five by five, six by six. But my spirit is growing seven by seven faster than the speed of light because light only penetrates the darkness that's already there. And I'm already there. I'm here at the end of the road to beginning of the road beyond time, but where are my niggas at? Oh shit, don't tell me my niggas got lost in time. My niggas are serving unjust time. My niggas are dying because of I'm gonna swap to you. <laughs> President of Archaeological Indifference, Vice President of Truth, Secretary of Statistics, Minister of Celebrity and Justice, Chief of Staff and Serpent, Chief of Staff and Serpent, Blessed Page Turner of the Great Book of Misdeeds and Overestimations. Bishop of the Great Climate War, Minister of the Deteriorating Sky, Baron of Epic Boredom and Self-Indulgence, All Gathered Notables, Good Evening. We come here tonight, off the top of our heads from the tips of our fingertips. The precipice of the soul. We think tonight on those floating in the Aegean, drowning in the Aegean, we think tonight of those in Calais, of those in Aleppo, of those in Bujumbura, those in Ferguson. Somehow, we 
find ourselves tonight here in this world on this planet in this country in this city on this stage of song. and face the firing squad. Every morning there's one who holds his fire. His dilemma is my system of belief. They fire rounds. They fire rounds. They fire rounds. seldom in their circle. that they face are the most pressing issues ever faced. But how do we face them? With our eyes closed, with our guitars in our laps, facing the stage under a spotlight, wishing for light, 
wishing for space. Citizens of the sea, citizens of the underworld, citizens of the overreach, citizens of our own fears. disenfranchisement, citizens of our, of our paranoia, of our xenophobia, of our doubts, of our questions, citizens, passport holders, we belong, we belong, supposedly, like I supposedly belong to this gender, like I supposedly belong to this race, like I supposedly belong, I don't belong. silent she birthed a nation of loud motherfuckers that set fire to her womb as they exited and called it the sun the father of sweat the father of rain father of heat comes humidity out of fire comes water and out of the sun's fire water came the plants and trees that call her name in the darkness as she stares one-eyed and raises the tide in an attempt to kiss the blood of her burning womb this is my blood which is shed for you motherfuckers of undeserving cyclops that she is she still gives even though we label her followers lunatics Thank mm -hmm. you. 
about 12 years old. He works in a mine. circuitry boards, a stone called Colton, Tanzelite, Cobalt, the word mine is an interesting one, because what is mine? better not to know. You don't want to know. You don't want to think about. You don't want to be made aware. You don't want to know. Trust me. But this boy's work is in your hand or pocket right now. Samsung, names like Nokia. The thing about, the thing about technology, technological advancements, digital, virtual, based on analog exploitation. Analog exploitation, the same old shit. They did it with rubber, they did it with cotton, they did it with sugar, they did it with oil, they did it with gold, and the only thing fucked up about that sentence is I put it in past tense because they do it, they do it, they do it, they do it, and we do it. Every day. Down for that ignorance. Nobody, nobody is immune to it. It takes on many shapes and forms. Many trends and norms. You get it sometimes. As soon as you're born, but you don't want to be born in the wrong place. At the wrong time. And in some places, it seems to be always the wrong time. This boy, this boy, he lives. He lives in the Congo. He lives in Rwanda. He lives in Nigeria. He lives in China. Just he, it ain't just he. 
is Him. Down from the ignorance, puppets of religion. Down for some ignorance, fear and superstition. Down for some ignorance, patriarchal mission. Down for some ignorance. Down for that ignorance. Down for that ignorance. Cause sometimes it's better not to know. You don't really want to know. Sometimes you don't even want to know the real history of your country. You don't really want to know what your tax dollars pay for. You don't really want to know how many weapons you've bought unsuspectingly wrapped in the comforts of your world, of your bubble, of your times, of your mind. You don't want to know. Down for that ignorance. Drown in that ignorance. Gender, the constructs of division, the constructs, the constructs, we built it. We motherfucking architects of our own demise. And I see it in your eyes. I see. Mais 
comme ça, on peut en parler. On peut, quoi. Des scoops. <rire> Désolé pour moi. Tu ne peux pas appeler rien. Quoi. Oh, that's great. <rire> that within all these things that most of us are already aware of, there are other things that we practice and experience, such as love. about being in love is you, you kind of, uh, you sense its power to transform how you look at things, about that question of belonging. Suddenly you belong to something bigger than yourself, a vision possibility. She kisses if she alone could forge the signature of the sun. I close my eyes though I never knew the difference. I stood before a brighter light. Lesser distance, and then a feeling, almost as if nothing were ever bound to be repeated ever again, as if history had been as massively created as the great pyramids, and to reconstruct or relive any given moment would have to stem from an understanding of how the pyramids were built, from the top down. such majesty, when we would also understand that pyramids were first made of flesh and that kisses are portals, our sacred breath shifting through hidden corrals and passageways, I will find my way to eternity. I can feel you breathing into me. I like some stone gargoyle atop some crumbling building, spring to life, a resuscitated angel. I sweep through city streets, my wings outstretched, making mothers clutch their young and remember. And do you remember, dear ones, or has your history forsaken you? There are mysteries coded in song, chant sung round fires, all incantations calling forth this day. On this day, the drunks vomit in unison the last night they drank from different cups. Children laugh and play, introducing their parents to invisible friends. A country girl smiles and two trees blossom out of season. Sea suns awaken, our mother has returned, but wave us from uncertainty once tidal. Twice born of wooden ships, thrice born through mother's hips. Mother's ships grace these two lips, a poet's garden. what grows in a poet's garden. What is it about poetry and love? Imagine. I would say that the poets are the original coders. They're reading algorithms, cultural algorithms, deciphering them 
recoding them, juxtaposing ideas to illuminate possibilities, boiling down emotions to their essence, and that essence is always love. as we see it because we love it like we love our possibilities like we love life like we love breath like we love music and sound dietary sustenance, tradition versus breath. Hack into comfort, compliance. Hack into the rebellious gene, hack into doctrine, capitalism in relation to free labor and slavery. Hack into the history of the bank. Is beating the odds in your act of joining the winning team, hacking the desperation and loneliness, hacking to the history of community in the marketplace, hacking the land rights and ownership, hacking the business law proprietorship, hacking to ambition and greed, hacking the forms of government systems of control, the relation of suffering and sufferance, hacking the faith and morality, the treatment of one faith towards another, hacking the masculinity, femininity, sexuality, what is taught, what is felt, what is learned, what is shared, hacking the God, stories of creation, serpents and eggs. Hacking the nature, biodynamics, biodiversity, cycles and seasons. Hacking the time, calendars, Descartes, its relationship to doubt. Is it wired to fear, the notion of control, the space-time continuum, the force of gravity, whether the opposite of gravity is freedom. Hacking the freedom, power, responsibility, justice, the Bill of Rights. Hacking the coincidence, the sum of 68, the 27 club, the number of people with Facebook profiles, people choose to share, people share too much, people seem lonely, people want to connect, people want to uplift. Hacking the self-help, self-sufficiency, and self-indulgence. Hacking the crazy, hacking the lunatic, hacking the star, hacking the infamous, notorious, the effects of the construct of poverty on the psyche, the effects of the construct of race, the victims that survive. There is a panel marked survival. Three simple copper wires coiled round an orb, hacking the orbit, equatorial landmines, useful and precious metals, Colton as cotton, hacking the hazardous, nuclear, blue clear, cloud forms and fish farms, cow farts and pig shit, hacking the horse, industrial digital, hacking the code, use your instrument as a metaphor, harness your craft. Hack into the mainframe, dismantle definition, dogma and duty. Hack into destiny, hack into dream, subtext and subconscious. Hack into heart, cardio, Congo, blood rich and oil. Hack into suffering and despair. Hack into the unfair advantage of those lucky enough to be born into one family or another, under one condition or another. Hack into the circumstantial evidence that proves the obvious and wakes the oblivious. Hack into birthright, bloodlines, royal and tainted. Hack into superstition, old wives' tales, the rituals of the shaman. Hack into DNA, chemistry, the pharmaceutical industry, the modern day rape of the forest. Hack into the coiling serpents, the time it takes for modern man to determine whether ancient women were foolish or not. Hack into the database. Hack into the subconscious, the panel mark survival. Hack into the celebrity. Hack into the cultural development of taste. Hack into violence, fear, and ignorance. 
How are they linked? Je vais euh, essayer. Euh, <rires> merci. Moi, je vais faire encore une chose un peu plus ouais. Parce que moi, pour moi, moi, j'aime beaucoup. <rires> ouais. Ouais, 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 mais ça m'irait les, les filles quand même. Non? change over time. I remember when hacking was done with machetes. born 
every day. back to the one we push on through Presses his vile rhythm into that hollowed piece of wood. We all feel it. And that's harmony. That's connection. Synchronicity. He brought us into his world. I bring you into mine. 
for a moment. Time is money, money is time, so I keep seven o'clock in the bank and gain interest in the hour of God. I'm saving to buy my freedom, God grant me wings, I'm too fly, not too fly. I soar to that humans without wings, so I soar and find tickle in the feathers of my wings. Flying hysterically over land numerically, I am seven mountains higher than the valley of death, seven dimensions deeper than dimensions of breath. The fiery sun of my passions evaporates the love lakes of my soul, clouds my thoughts and rains you into existence as I take flight on bolts of lightning, claiming chaos as my concubine, and you as my me, I of the storm, you of the sea, we of the moon, land of the free, what have I done to deserve this? Am I happy? Happiness is a mediocre standard from middle class existence. I see through smiles and smell truth in the distance. Beyond one dimensional smiles and laughter lies a hereafter where tears echo laughter. You'd have to do math to divide a smile by a fear times fear. Because the mere truth that simply gels in the air, that's what I have to do is breathe and all else will follow. That's why drums are hollow. And I like drums. Drums are good, but I can't think straight. I lack the attention span to meditate. My attention spans galaxies here and now are immense. Seconds are secular, moments are mine. Self is illusion, music's divine. Noosed by the strings of Jimmy's guitar, I swing. Purple haze pendulum, hypnotizing the part of I that never dies. Look into my eyes through the windows of the solar try Chicken collards and cornbread. This cornmeal flash which makes no oil as the stolen blood of the earth. Used to make cars run and kill the fish. Who me? I play scales, the scales of dead fish of oil slick seas. My sister blows wind through the hollows of fallen trees. And we are the echoes of eternity, echoes of eternity, echoes of eternity. Maybe you heard of us. We do rebirths, revolts, and resurrections. We threw basement parties and pyramids. I left my tag on the wall. The beach would echo off the stone and solidify into the form of light bulbs. Destined life that heads of future generations. The reach up in the form of foam. Maybe you heard of us. If not, we must be trying to hear us, and in such cases we can't be heard. We remain in the darkness unseen. In the center of unpeeled bananas, we exist, uncolored by perception, clothed to the naked eye. Five senses cannot sense the fact of our existence, and that's only fact. In fact, there are no facts. Facts me a fact, and I'll telegram a hologram, a telephone, a son of man, and tell him he is done. Leave a message on his answer machine, telling him there are none. God and I are one, times moon, times star, times sun. The fact was me, you remember me, I slung amethyst rocks on Saturn blocks till I got caught up by earthling cops. They wanted me for their army or whatever. Picture me. I swirl like the wind, tempting tomorrow to be today, tiptoeing the fine line between everything and everything else. I am simply Saturn swirling sevens through sooth, the soul living air of air and I and it all else follows, reverberating the space inside of drum hollows, packaged in bottles and shipped to tomorrow, then sold to the highest nigger. I swing from the tallest tree, lynched by the lowest branches of me, praying that my physical will set me free because I'm afraid the little else is vanity. Mere language is profanity. I'd rather hum, have my soul tattooed to my tongue and let the scriptures be sung in gibberish. Those words be simple fish in my soul aquarium and intellect can't swim, so I stop combing my mind so my thoughts could lock. I'm tired of trying to understand. Perceptions are mangled, matted, and knotted anyway. Life is more than what meets the eye and eye. Celebrate eye to the third, but even that shit seems absurd. And their thoughts see you third, isolated. No man is an island, but I often feel alone. So I find peace through. Oh. 
Through meditation, I program my heart to beat break beats and hum bass lines and exhalation. <laughs> I burn seven day candles that melt into 12 inch circles on my mantle and spin funk like myrrh. <laughs> Boom. And I can fade worlds in and out with my mixing patterns. Letting the earth spin as I blend in Saturn. Niggas be like spin windmills, braiding hair, lock and pop it as the sonic force of the soul keeps the planets rocking. The beat don't stop when soul this matter flows into the cosmos, trying to be stars. The beat don't stop when the earth sends out satellites, his fire on Saturnites and control Mars. His niggas got a peace treaty with Martians, and we be keeping them up to date from sacred gibberish like show enough. And it's on. The beat goes on. The beat goes on. The beat goes And I roam through the streets of downtown Venus, trying to auction off monuments of Osiris's severed penis, but no one with penis in Venus for androgynous cosmology sets their spirits free. And they neither men nor women be, but they be down with the billion niggas who have yet to see that interplanetary truth is androgynous. And they be sending us shout outs through shooting stars, and niggas be like, what up? And talking Mars, because we are so large, regardless of how far we roam from home, the universe remains our center. Like, Oh, oh, I am no earthling. I drink moonshine on Mars and mistake meteors for stars as I can't hold my liquor, but I can hold my breath and ascend like wind to the black hole and play galaxophones on the fire escapes of your soul, blowing tunes to lunar wombs, impregnating stars, giving birth to suns that darken the skins that skin our drums, and we be beating infinity over sacred hums, spinning funk like myrrh until Jesus comes, and Jesus comes every time he drums, the moon drips blood and eclipses the sun, and out of darkness comes the poof, poof, poof. and out of darkness comes the poof, poof, poof. and out of darkness this comes up. So, ça c'est un ancien poème de l'année, je sais pas, 96. Chose comme ça, à la début de mouvement qui s'appelle Slap. I stand on the corner of the block slinging amethyst rocks. Drinking 40s and Mother Earth's private nectar stop. Dodging cops cause 5-0 be the 666 and I need to fix that purple rain. The type of shit that drives membranes insane. Oh yeah, I'm in the fast lane snorting candy yams that free my body and soul and send me like Shazam. Never question who I am. God knows and I know God personally. In fact, he lets me call him me. I be one with rain and stars and things with dancing feet and watermelon wings. I bring the sunshine and the moon and the wind blows my tune. Meanwhile, I spoon powder drum beats in the plastic. Bags, selling kilos of kente skag, taking drags off of collards and cornbread, freebasing through saxophones and flutes like mad. The high notes make me space float. I be exhaling in rings that circle Saturn, leaving stains in my veins and astrological patterns. Yeah, I'm serious, B. Doggone niggas plotted shit lovely, but the feds is also plotting me. They're trying to imprison my astrology, put my stars behind bars, my stars and stripes using blood splattered banners as nationalist kites. But I control the wind, that's why they call it the whole. I am Horus, son of Isis, son of Osiris, worshipped as Jesus, resurrected like Lazarus. You call me Lazy, lazy. Yeah, I'm lazy because I'd rather sit and build a work and plow a field, worshipping a daily yield of cash green crops. Your evolution stopped with the evolution of your technology, a society of automatic tellers and money machines. Nigga, what? My culture is llama beans and tambourines, dreams, manifest, dreams real, not consistent with rationale. 
I dance for no reason, for reason you can't dance, call it the enactimus of intellectualized circumstance. You can't learn my steps until you unlearn your thoughts, spirit, soul, can't be straw-bored. Fuck thought, at least not, simply state at least to you, trying to figure me out. Your intellect is figuring your soul, your being's not whole. Check your flagpole, stars and stripes, your astrology's imprisoned by your concept of wider self. But your plan for spiritual health, calling reality unreal, your line of thought is spank tangled. The star spangled, got your soul mangled, your being's angled, forbidding you to be real and feel. You can't find truth with an axe or a in a white house on a hill and factories of plants made of steel. Stealing us was the smartest thing you ever did. Too bad you don't teach the truth to your kids. My influence on you is the reflection you see when you look into your menstrual mirror and talk about your culture. Your existence is that of a schizophrenic vulture who thinks they have enough life in him to prey on the dead, not knowing that the real dead ain't dead and he ain't got enough spirituality to know how to pray. Yet it's no repentance, you're bound to live an infinite consecutive executive life sentence. So while you're out busy serving time, I'll be in sync with the moon while you run from the sun. Life of the womb reflected by guns. Worship of moons, I am the sun and I am public enemy number one. One, one, one. <laughs> we have an election coming up in the place where I'm from. Maybe you've heard about it. <laughs> the election is rigged. Uh, politics themselves are, uh, you know, it's a game of strategy, no? It's, it's chess, not checkers. It's, uh, it's an interesting moment. Citizens, children of the night, bearers of the day, torch scorched and burned, burn not, the dam is broken, the curse is fled. Once muddied and still, the river runs red. All those ships that never sailed, the ones with their seacocks open that light scuttled in their stalls today, I bring them back, huge and transitory, and let them sail forever, forever, the recurrence on current, the wind cannot serve a truth's currency, currently moon-marked and sun-sparked, unmarked bills, will I am certain I speak a new language, as is always the first sign of a new age. I've begun to believe my blackened toenails run path to decay when in truth they had begun a gradual process of crystallization. Sweet of toenails of amethyst and rose quartz. <laughs> Wind scorned feet. My path now crystal clear. I am come to tell you, she is here. It is not written. No penman ship was ever cargoed with her character. Note books are carefully folded forests, void of autumn, bound from the sun. Likewise, she made residence on the outskirts of history, on the dark side of the moon, where the searchlight of the sun cannot spot her nor rot her. The seed of forbidden fruit, every tree has a hidden root, yet she has come to light the swelling patrick of vibrant dreams and to think of the girlfriend I was tempted to break up with because she slept too much. I now know. <laughs> They nurtured her there. They slept in packs, dreamt in cycles, nursed her in ships, and became her on rotation. Unnamed every time she was named that she would not be known even unto herself. Undressed every time she was dressed that she would not be recognized in one of the van herself. They blindfolded her and spun her in circles that she would find a way here with other means in her intuition. And she has come. I am a simple disoriented man in her presence. I wear my loincloth over my eyes and ejaculate too soon. Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. I prayed to you and cup the wind, and in doing so, barred her entry into a century, 100 years of solitude. I will now pray with my hands outstretched with these psalms etched into my palms. Most beloved, I am certain of nothing more than your existence. A thousand ants crawling under a log may find themselves exposed to my childlike search for you. 
מלכהו. Fly. I am eternally destroyed by your love. No longer by eligible for any workers' pension. My friends laugh at me and talk behind my back. They say that you've changed me, and I am. I'm like survivor of the flood, walking through the streets, drenched with God. Surprised at all the drowned victims are still walking and talking. Maybe there's hope. I rush to each victim's side, sucking what I can be out of your various incarnations, pumping their stomachs and filling them to touch them is to touch you, to kiss them is to kiss you. My friends, love is an art form slightly removed from its element. Now one may ask, what does this mean? I respond, I've made it up, but it shall be from now on. From now on, cities will be built on one side of the street so that soothsayers will have wilderness to wander and lovers space enough to contemplate a kiss. She kisses if she alone could forge a signature of the sun. I closed my eyes, though I never knew the difference. I stood before a brighter light at lesser distance and then a feeling, almost as if nothing were ever bound to be repeated ever again, as if history had been as massively created as the great pyramids to reconstruct, we live any given moment that the stem from an understanding of how the pyramids were built from the top down, and one could understand such majesty. One would also understand that pyramids were first made of flesh, and that kisses are portals, our sacred breath shifting through hidden corrals and passageways. I will find my way to eternity within me. And I can feel you breathing into me. I like a stone gargoyle atop some crumbling building. Spring to life, a resuscitated angel. I sweep through city streets, my wings outstretched, making mothers clutch their young and remember. And do you remember, dear ones, or has your history forsaken you? There are mysteries coded in song, chants, sung round fires, all incantations calling forth this day. On this day, the drunks vomit in unison. Last night, they drank from different cups. Children laugh on pain, introducing their parents to invisible friends. A country girl smiles and two trees blossom out of season. Sea suns awaken. A mother has returned. A wave of uncertainty once titled. Twice born of wooden ships. Thrice formed to mother's hips. Mother ships grace two lips a poet's garden. Two for five. The going fast. The future's bargain. That change. I heard my name. The river's parting. Hurry up things. Hurry up. The sun is darkened. Rivers like oceans. Oceans like answers. Questions in cloud forms. Raindrops and stanzas. To be or not to. To see or not to. She had eyes like two turntables. Mixed her in between. My dreams and reality blend in the ancient themes. The basis of Isis cross faded to Ankh. The beat drops like a cliff overlooking my heart. 6,000 feet above sea level. 3,300 bodies disassembled. The egg bones connected to the cockpit. Knee jerk, ass backwards, dancing slaves in a mosh pit. Punk rock of Gibraltar roll out, nothing's new. More blood dies than Mohawk, only this time it's you. And you never loved her for what she possessed. You powdered her face and came on her headdress. Oil slick feathers, featured stench, waterbed. Mother nature's a whore, said the shotgun to the head. And it smelled like teen spirit. Angst-driven, insecure, a country in puberty, a country at war. You see, the greatest Americans have not been born yet. They're waiting patiently for the past to die. Please give blood. Those crumbled tablets were to share a story with a burning bush. Where is that voice from nowhere to remind us that the holy ground we walk on, purified by native blood, has rooted trees whose fallen leaves now color code the sacred list of demands? Who amongst us can give translation of autumn hues to morning news? The anchor man thrown overboard has simply rooted us in history's repeating cycle. A nation in its saddened years that won't acknowledge karma. Where is that voice from nowhere? The ones your prophets spoke of. For I hear voices of fear disconnected from their diaphragms, dangling from coffee-covered teeth that spill into our laps and scorch our privates. Their voices from the sides of necks, some already noosed, dangling participles, pronouns running for sentence, serving life in corner offices and ghetto corners. Their voices are the same dead to themselves, numb to the possibility of truth existing beyond that which they can palm in their hands, period. There are voices of elders, which seem to do no more than damn us to our childish ways from many households. Wisdom no longer comes with age. So where is that voice from nowhere? 
that burning bush, that passing dove. I hear the voices of generals calling for ammunition, presidents calling for arms, and women calling for help. Where is that voice from nowhere? That God of Abraham, can he be heard up at the gunfire? The whiz of passing missiles, the crash of buildings, the shriek of sirens, the crack of bones, the cries of children, or is that his mighty voice? Your angry God craving the sacrifice of virgin generation, sons degenerate. Your holy books written in red ink on burning sands. Your prayers between rounds no more than fast the fate of your children to the hammered truth of your trigger, a truth that mushrooms its darkened cloud over the rest of us so that we too bear witness to the short-lived fate of a civilization that worships a male god. Your weapons are phallic, all of them. That dummy that sits in your lap is no longer a worthwhile spectacle. His shrunken, pale face is in a room for imagination. We have spotted in moving lips that pin the voice to his proper source. It is a source of madness, a source of hunger for power, a source of weakness, a source of evil. We are exiting a coliseum and encircling a box office, demanding our families back, our culture back, our language back, our gods back. So we turn them to the proper source, the source of life, the source of creation, our mother's womb, the great goddess who will cut through the barbara our hangers and chastity belts. We will climb in and incubate our spirits through the winter. We will wait through the degenerate course of your repeated history. We will wait for the past to die. So, thank you, a few parting words. Can I see the audience? possible pour moi euh, voir les gens ah, bonsoir um, bon first I, I like to thank you all for being here um, it's, it's, it's a gift to be invited to Maison de la Poésie to, uh, to share work it's actually very strange for me to be uh, doing like a poetry reading room like with the exception of what Sammy brought to the table without music here in France, just because of the so-called language barrier. But I learned something here in France a long time ago um, when I came here with my film Slam, which was that when you speak from a certain place, when it's rooted in something and grounded in something, there's no such thing as a language barrier. And I think, um, you know, it's been beautiful to, to, uh, to see, uh, you know, uh, Debbie and, and Elise uh, did an interview today and we were talking about the slam, you know, all that stuff in, in, in France and across the world and poetry and, and the cycles of popularity and, and, and not. What's beautiful to me, of course, and to many about the city, uh, of course, has a lot to do with culture and taste and, and an appreciation of something, you know, something that's continuing through the times. But there's other things that continue through the times, like the type of exploitation you were talking about, the type of obliviousness and you know, things that come with privilege and not having to think about something because it doesn't affect you and so you don't think about it. And you think of the misogyny that's handed down through time and all of these things that that, that I think many of us are, are writing poems oftentimes to, to play our part in destroying and shifting. And... Um, Being said, you know, as I was saying, there's a there's a lot going on, as we all know. It's uh, there's Brexit over there. There's Calais over there. Marie Le Benson over there. Sarkozy over there. Trump over there. <laughs> Turkey over there. Greece over there. Right? Colombia, Honduras over there. Brazil. Do the win. Durumaho. Claro que sí.
Yeah. Yet in all, it's still a wonderful time to be alive. Imagine that. I mean, we couldn't be alive at any other time that we can think of. I mean, it's, it's, it's how we do it. But it's interesting to play with the idea of making, you know, the time that you're alive, making it mean something. And of course, it's not only through the arts, it's through whatever your passion is, you know, attach yourself and your vision to that thing, whether you're an engineer, whether you're a teacher, a historian, you know, you work in IT, whatever the fuck you do. You do it without letting it, you know. I got a friend, for example, who uh, he works in IT, you know, and computers and shit. And so he hangs around with a lot of like startup people. I notice him becoming like more and more libertarian, like <coughs> more uh, talking about his things. Like, I'm so mad about those fucking emails. You guys are already here, so I'm kind of preaching to the choir. <laughs> you go to places like Maison de la Poésie, <laughs> the Cote de Nicoa. <laughs> well, yeah. Yeah, it's true. It's true. The first time I went to a poetry reading, I hated it. I was like, what the fuck? I never want to hear the word revolution again. <laughs> but I can't deny that uh, anything with as inclusive of, of voices, of, of women's voices, of unheard voices, of disenfranchised voices, any place that makes itself open to that has a way and a means of going, hold. Hey. And there's this poem, a Sufi poem, uh, one of my favorite poets, Hafiz, who says, the other is a lie. The other is a lie. And that's been kind of my, uh, my motto as I've moved through things and places, arriving in places where I'm like, whoa, I'm in Bulgaria. What the fuck is this? I'm like, oh, the other is a lie. Oh, okay. <laughs> we have something in common. community to its drum woven past. Whereas the quantized drummers allow the whirling mathematicians to calculate the ever-changing distance between rock and stardom. Whereas the velocity of spinning vinyl cross-faded spun backwards and re-released at the same given moment of recorded history, yet at a different moment in time's continuum has allowed history to catch up with the present. 
We do hereby declare reality unkept by the changing standards of dialogue statements such as keep it real, especially when punctuating or anticipating modes of ultra violence inflicted psychologically or physically will henceforth be seen as retroactive and not representative of the individually determined is. Furthermore, as determined by the collective consciousness of this state of being and the lessened distance between thought patterns and their secular manifestations, the role of men as listening receptacles is to be increased by number no less than 70% of the current enlisted as vocal aggressors. Motherfuckers better realize. Now is the time to self-actualize. We have found evidence that hip-hop standard 85 RPM when increased by number of least half the rate of its standard or decreased three quarters of its speed may be a determining factor in heightening consciousness. Studies show that many given norm has changed in the face of the unchanging. The remaining contradictions will parallel the truth, equate rhyme with reason, sun with season. Our cyclical relationship to phenomenon has encouraged scholars to erase a series of periods, thus symbolizing the nonlinear character of cause and effect. Reject mediocrity. Your current frequencies of understanding outweigh that which has been given for you to understand. The current standard is the equivalent of an adolescent restricted the diet of an infant. The rapidly changing body would acquire this functional deformative symptoms and could not properly mature on a diet of applesauce and crushed peers. Light years are interchanged with years of living in darkness. The role of darkness is not to be seen as or equated with ignorance but with the unknown and the mysteries of the unseen. Thus, in the name of Robeson, Godson, Hurston, Akhenaten, Hatshepsut, Blackfoot, Helen, Lennon, Kahlo, Kali, the Three Marias, Tara, Lilith, Lord, Whitman, Baldwin, Ginsburg, Kaufman, Lumumba, Gandhi, Gibran, Shabazz, Siddhartha, Medusa, Gurdjieff, Rand, Wright, Banneker, Tubman, Hamer, Holiday, Davis, Coltrane, Morrison, Joplin, The Voice, Clark, Shakespeare, Rachmaninoff, Ellington, Carter, Day, Hathaway, Hendrix, Kuti, Dickinson, Ripperton, Mary, Isis, Teresa, Hansberry, Tesla, Plath, Rumi, Fellini, Michaud, Nostradamus, Nefertiti, Larak, Shiva, Ganesha, Yemaya, Oshun, Obatala, Ogun, Kennedy, King, Four Little Girls, Hiroshima, Nagasaki, Keller, Biko, Marley, Magdalene, Shakur, those who burn, those still aflame, and the countless unnamed. We claim the present as the present, as the hereafter. We are dragging our navels that we may ingest the sun. We are not afraid of the darkness. We trust that the moon shall guide us. We are determining the future at this very moment. We know that the heart is a philosopher's stone. Our music is our alchemy. We stand as a manifest equivalent of, of three buckets of water and a handful of minerals, thus realizing that those very buckets turned upside down supply the percussive factor of forever. If you must count to keep the beat, then count. Find your mantra and awaken your subconscious. Carve your circles counterclockwise. Use your cipher to decipher coded language, man-made laws. Climb waterfalls and trees. Commune with nature, snakes and bees. Let your children name themselves and claim <coughs> themselves as the new day. For today, we are determined to be the channelers of these changing frequencies in the songs, <coughs> paintings, writings, dance, Drama, photography, carpentry, crafts, love, and love. We enlist every instrument, acoustic, electronic, every so-called gender, race, sexual orientation, every person as beings of sound to acknowledge your responsibility to uplift the consciousness of the entire fucking world. Any utterance unaimed will be disclaimed, will be maimed. Two rappers slain. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.